Okay, Juan Martin, take us back to baby Juan. How, how old were you when you first started to develop the forehand that we know and love today? Well, uh, I was a, a kid when I hold the, the, the first racket. I was seven years old. And I had uh, luck because my, my coach from, from kid was a uh, special coach on hard courts. Mm -hmm. So they, he teach me a, a different forehand than the rest of Argentinian players, right. you know? And I think that's why I have this kind of forehands working good on hard courts. Yeah, well, I wanted to ask you that. You have a little bit less of a Western grip. You hit it a little bit flatter. Was that all due to that coach, or is that something that you think came naturally for you? Well, I think now I'm doing naturally, but uh, I learned this this forehand when I was a kid, you know, and then I, I've been working hard uh, every practice on my forehand because I, I found that it's my, my best shot on, on the <laughs> game. and and I like to hit uh, flat in every surface because I, 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 I feel the ball going really fast and, and I think it's, it's a little bit different uh, between my forehand and the rest of the players. So I am 5'4", I'm more than a foot shorter than you are. Do you think it's possible for someone, say my height, to technically develop a forehand like yours or do you think part of the reason it works so well is because you're almost two meters tall? <laughs> no, no, I, I think uh, everybody can, can hit uh, a flat forehand. It depends on the technique and, and the, the coach who teach uh, the forehand, but I think it's just a, a specific technique to, to hit flat, but then you can use in all surface. So it's, it's, uh, it's not a, that, that difficult forehand, but you have to, to learn that from, from kids. So there's hope for me, you're saying? No, you are looking good. <laughs> you can. Amazing. Uh, can you remember back to a particular forehand that you think was maybe the best that you ever hit? Whether it was the situation in a match or the reaction of the crowd, is there one that sticks out to you or two? Yeah, I, I could take uh, the final of the US Open mm -hmm. against Russia. I was uh, set down and my forehand was uh, going that, that, fast, that fast, but after uh, the second set, the crowd was uh, going crazy with my, with my forehands and I got too much power from the crowd, so I, I was hitting harder and harder, and then I became to, to, to play my, my best forehand ever. And then I could also take a, a breaker against Dominic Thiem. Yes, I know I this think, forehand yeah, that you're talking about. <laughs> it was a set point, I mm -hmm. think, in the four sets. Uh, and it was amazing because after that winner, I saw the crowd uh, crazy <laughs> and uh, I still remember that, that shot. Yeah. Well, speaking, I believe it was that shot that you're talking about a couple years ago at the US Open. And it was turned into a, a little meme on Twitter with you holding Thor's hammer, yeah. Juan Martin del Thortro. When you saw that, and even Roger Federer tweeted it, what was your reaction to that? Uh, it, was, it was funny to, <laughs> to watch uh, that every player was talking about my yeah. forehand, about my, my new nickname on tour. Yeah. And, and then I, I got a couple of, of hammers on the tour to, to hold from, from the tour. And, and I like this uh, new nickname on, yeah. on me, and I'm still working hard to, to hit even better my forehands. On social media, your forehand, you in general, but your forehand is a hot topic. It's something that people talk about all the time when they're watching your matches. You're on Twitter. Do you see any of that reaction? And what's your reaction to knowing that it makes people so happy? Well, I, I like when the people go crazy about uh, yeah. a part of my game, you know, but I, I know how big is my forehand and how the people love my, my, my forehand too, so I'm trying to first to do my job and then right, if right. I can play a, a special shot from the crowd, I will do it. Fantastic. Well, I think we learned everything there is to know about your forehand today, except perhaps how to actually hit it. But Juan Martin Del Portro, thank yeah. you so much and no, best of luck in Delray. Thank you very much.